This is the real Tom Rose, and we're trying to figure out um, the length of the radius of this circle, right? And they give us chord length. They tell you have a chord length of eight. No, they say you sorry. They tell you have a chord length of sixteen, um, which means that this length from C over to the edge, that length is eight. That's going to be important. And, and the reason why that's going to be important is because I'm going to find, remember when you're finding the radius, it's the distance between the center O to the edge of the circle. And you can draw it anywhere. You could draw it here. You could draw it there. Um, so I'm going to choose strategically to draw it, boom, right here to this point where so I can create a triangle. And I'm creating that triangle on purpose because it's a right triangle. And I already know two of the sides, 6 and 8. Now there's a special right triangle you should have memorized, which is three, four, five. It's called a Pythagorean triple, where if you know two of the sides are three and four, you know the third side will be five. Now, um, obviously that doesn't apply exactly in this case, but multiples of all Pythagorean triples are also Pythagorean triples. So double all of these and you have six, eight, 10. And that's the triangle that does, that does play here. So we have one side is six, one side is eight. We know the radius will then be 10, so that's the first answer choice.